What I have not seen yet is Lithuanians on the new patch. So I'm really curious how they are going to be played out in the future. It'd be cool. And we see we're interested in playing them right now. Main gold. Rather close to the TC. Not that far away. And also well positioned. It's not too far away into the front. So I would not complain about the main gold. Main stone is uh, horrible though. The wood lines seem to be very nice. Very standard here. Berries in the back as well. So he should be very safe in Chester. I, I guess. Um, on the other side we have Mr. Yo playing Pulse. Mangold short or close to the TC, but very forward. Stone looks much better compared to his uh, counterpart. Berries are okay. You can wall them in here uh, with the full works. You need some space, but you will get that. So that's okay for uh, the pole player. And the wood lines look very good as well. I really like uh, Mr. Yo's map here because he's going to wall like this, there, there, there. And there, and then go crazy with poles. Just go crazy. Super easy walls for Winchester as well. Yeah. Uh, there's puffer zone where the castle still hits when the unit was in range when the shot went off. Yeah, it is true. It I have never seen it being so impactful though, like uh, previous game. Right. Do the arrow fire from castle and TC follow the units if they go out of range while shooting? Yeah, Hibachi, Backseat Gamer just answered that question. Yo will even have his secondary gold inside the walls, which is super helpful as well. Yeah, Silly, Luffy, thank you, sir, for the 10 months. Um, Are you guys fine having the range indicator? I think it is good to have it. What do you guys prefer? I'm, I'm open for changing that. I think we still have to... Predictions. <clears throat> this outcome, uh, Mr. Yo. Yo. Ah, guys. Has uh, the prediction for game two already been uh, submitted? I was not following. Has a mod done that already? Can you give me a feedback, please? Okay, uh, has the prediction for game three already been uh, been done? It kind of looks like that. I didn't uh, follow that, unfortunately. What happened to the bird on Winchester's TC? <laughs> oh, this is a good one. <laughs> What the fuck? What the fuck? Yo! What's happening? That bird is stuck. It's stuck. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. They would be proud of you, Jordan. Thank you. I promise. Them. Donate to China. Want to break free? Yeah. To restart, please help. Well, we will check back on later if uh, that one is still there. Let's see. The discrepancy, nice. Did, now, now that someone has mentioned that there is a bird over Winchester's TC, I'm actually getting annoyed by that one. Top patch, ay ay ay, that sucks. That really sucks. I wish you a very quick, very very quick. Um, recovery. And I think I know how I can speed up the recovery. Give me a second. Now 
No, oh, that should work. That should work for sure. No, that works even better. Actually, this is scary right now. I don't want to, I don't want to, you know, break it and have fun. Okay, Mr. Yo, up to fuel age. <laughs> I think I'm dead. <laughs> oh, it's, that's a good thing. Um, yeah, Winchester, not going to be able to do anything here. And uh, we will just see Mr. Yo being happy with the situation. He's fine. This is a very chill game so far. Oh, the bird has escaped! The bird has actually escaped. Where did it go? Oh, and the villager went down as well. Oh. Nice. Okay, where did it go? Wow, it escaped, guys. It escaped. Okay. Good stuff. Good that we talked about it. Yeah, good engagement for uh, Winchester. He's going to be able to uh, kill the Spearman now. And now Mr. Yo kind of uh, forced to add another Spearman. It ate the feudal hit, made it guess. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh shit. Maybe it's not as chill as I thought it would be. I think Winchester should be up to Fuel Age a little bit faster. Uh, to Castle Age. But Mr. Yo's economy is obviously going to be stronger. And second, uh, full work incoming. What? direction is Winchester going to head into and the question for me is will we see Mr. Yo going for lighties or for cavalry that's what I'm wondering right now should Yo tower up his gold no he should not he doesn't see any aggression from Winchester and he can always fall back onto this gold if this was his only goal, then you could make the argument, yeah. Okay, knight, mill rusher. You know which uh, direction I went for. I, I have the feeling that today, people, some people, only very few people, are very precise with everything. Cast agent coming for Vinch. I guess we will see second stable and one monastery. Close. The good thing for Winchester is that he has scouts on the f on the field, so he's going to be able to scout where exactly the relics are going to be spawning, and that helps a lot for Lithuanians. I like the fact that Mr. Yo is adding a stable now as well because he needs to get scouts on the field as well. If Yo goes lightest, I'd be super surprised. He is not. He's not doing that. So I will just go cavalry. Yeah, TJ, uh, vacation was good. I was chilling a lot, and now I have to get back my motivation. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm working on it. You know, I'm working on it. I'm the type of guy who always needs some time to get adjusted again. But we have time. Before King of the Desert, so that's that's good. Okay, we have Castle Age 30 seconds away. Uh, Mysterio is roughly 1 minute and 10 seconds behind Winchester here. Scouts are from both sides looming around. We see the forward PC. Oh, now I understand it. Oh, now I understand it. Mr. Yo is Pauls. What, what, what was I talking about? 
Man, I have a brain fog. Hallelujah. No rage for us today? No, not today. Uh, nice uh, pick off by Mr. Yo. It took me almost 20 minutes to realize that. Yeah, what can I say? Disaster? Absolute disaster? Vinches is going for uh, lighties. I told you guys. I told you. But always listen to me. Panic. Yeah. <sighs> Minch goes lighties, Zeus goes monks, Yo goes lighties. All part of the plan. Yeah, that was the idea. Winchester has gotten so sloppy after missing out on Rappel. I highly disagree. I think Winchester is playing the best he has ever done. Donut free food for Winchester now. Yes, you can see here. He got he's gotten a lot of food now. Is Ganja top five player now? No. I think Mr. Yo has uh, to go light his directly as well to counter it. Okay, okay, okay. We understood the joke. I uh, misspelled something for a long time. For a very long time. It's not that funny. It's not. Nice uh, pick off by Winchester. 42 villagers against 38. However, we see Wilbur incoming from Mr. Yo. So, villager wise, equal, I would claim. Uh, but economy should be better for Mr. Yo here. Yeah. It will grow further and further now. Well, his tournament performance has decreased. Good, good. In Rappel before that second place on King of the Desert. Now, nowadays, not so well. Uh, he qualified for DreamHack, was not allowed to play there, or was not able to play there. He got top 8 in NAC. Where the first 3 sets he played went 3-2 all the time. I would not claim that this is a bad performance at all. Does he see all relics? Let's check that. So how is the relic situation? No one has picked up any relic yet. Winchester has here. Let's see how well Winchester is going to, uh, to do that. And he has actually managed to get a converse, uh, conversion here. I was about to say conver conversation. That doesn't make sense. Wouldn't you say that top 8 is below Winchester's capacity? No. Actually, no. <laughs> I would not say so. Is that a jab at drone's capacity? <laughs> oh, Winchester is better than me. Yeah, yeah, Winchester is better than me. I think so. Uh, we see one relic for each player now. We have Winchester secures this one with a light calf. This one not protected though. And Winchester is sending his units over to this place now. Uh, this one is going to be picked off. This one is going to be picked off as well. Nice. Uh, nicely done by Mr. Yo. He's going to grab this relic as well. By the looks of it. Mr. Yo or Winchester doesn't really have any units going forward there. However, this relic should be picked off by Winchester as well. And this one as well. So, we will most likely have three relics against two. 
Let's use the casting and arena game. You're welcome. Winchester has the capability to beat any top player in tournament settings. Yes, I agree. Is uh, Winch guard command with his spears? No, it's just uh, box formation. Woo, 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 woo. Pick off, pick off by Mysterio, pick off by Mysterio, and he's escaping with those two light cap as well. Uh, really annoying, but doesn't matter. Three relics are going to be collected by by Winchester. And now we see the lighty play, while on the other side we have Slachta privilege already upgraded, I suppose. Last privilege. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, those lighties have to come out really, really fast. And I think it's not going to be fast enough. And those night, night spams are going to be insane. Let's see. In my head, Winchester is going to uh, be completely overwhelmed. Let's see. Uh, Tiramis, yeah, it is. It is a cool show match. Uh, garrison those mugs! Oh, that was a close one. Is Spikeman safer and better scaling play? I would. I think so. Yeah. Dr. Difa, thank you for the two months. Jib clown. The good old Jib clown. Yeah, Winchester is lacking walls. That's kind of a typical thing for him. <clears throat> I mean, Orbuk and Night play is going to be so deadly to the Lithuanian player. Really, really going to be lethal. You see conversions happening here. Nice. Oh. But uh, the funny thing is, Monsieur doesn't care anymore. He does not care. Uh, and privilege resources are there for Winchester. So if he's going to be able to secure himself here, wall here, damn, nice. He should not be. Oh! Not being able to wall here. I love the fact that he actually jumped into the TC with the monk. Um, yeah. Not going for the Imperial Age play. I like that. It's too risky. If he would have been able to wall these knights out, then you could make the argument for that. But the way it is right now, yeah, you will lose too much economy. The Vinch is to mix in pikes to not get overwhelmed. Uh. Eh. Ideally, Winchester defends with the Lithuanians, uh, with Lighties right now, but he will have to mix in Halberdiers, I suppose. And privilege uh, incoming for both players now. It looks rough for Winchester because he always has to garrison his villagers and uh, therefore his uh, economy is going to be idle. Right, and economy, look at the economy by player six full works already very beautiful <laughs> that was a good save by Winchester Able to wall his villagers that were building the castle. So that is, uh, you know, saves him the, the game so far. Which is completely fine in your opinion? Nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. I mean, he has a beautiful army with the ladies. But I think longevity... Economy-wise, Winchester is going to fall behind heavily. Yeah, 3,000 already. Was it 32 or 30? No, 5,000.
And now Yo actually attacks into Pikeman. S that surprised me heavily. Four castles already by Winchester. Love that. Oh, Lighty, like, Pikeman cannot be the play here. Just cannot. You need Cap only. Cap fully. Lighties are just going to thread pikemen. Uh, Poles don't have access to Halberdier. <coughs> Drop rotation. Very important for Poles as well. Okay, Monsieur. We're 46 farmers right now. Increasing and increasing. Which is a bit 40. So food income is heavily going to be in favor of Mysterio. Yeah, it's for the lighties production. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Beasley. Uh, he needs the castles for the unique unit. And now... I feel like... <sighs> 31 lighties against 19. Winchester has potential. Crush this position with his lighties. Elite, Elite is incoming in 15 seconds, guys. Iron casting in as well. This should be 14 plus... Uh, 13 plus 5. Yeah. And this is going to be a good engagement for Vinch, in my opinion. Elite lighties, guys. They throw a punch. Oh, Elite is 16. What the hell? <coughs> wow. Yeah, completely obliterating everything on its way. And Winchester, all of a sudden, has the momentum swing or shift. 106 villages against 138, but 33 army against 10. And uh, that says it all. That says it all, guys. Light is broken. Yeah, light is are not too bad. They are not too bad. And they are also... The elite upgrade is rather cheap as well. Need Botkin at least. Yeah, he doesn't have uh, the economy. Like... He wants to... Well, he has the economy. But he wants to invest resources into military. It's hard. It definitely is hard. Uh, Arbalest Obo is the best... I have against Lightis on paper. Uh, I still think full calf, calf play should be the play. Don't switch into pikemen, go full calf. You should overwhelm in theory. At least in my head. Missio still has better population overall. 160 against 130. Winchester... Winchester's economy is just not there, right? I also don't understand why Mr. Yo went for Imperial Age. I uh, think it makes more sense to all in and cast Age. Especially because why uh, Winchester played so open. Floating 1k food plus gold. Yeah, that, that definitely hurts. Do we see Doubt Castle? Doughty incoming? Looks like that. Also, oh no, you don't want to go Winged Hussars against... Against the Lighties. Oh, that hurts. <clears throat> Vinch is lacking Siege now. He honestly doesn't really need Siege. You can just raid your opponent to death. At this point, you cannot do anything anymore in Paul's shoes. Even if you have better economy. Like, there, there's nothing you can do. Those uh, lighties are just going to uh, obliter obliterate everything. The thing about it, lighties... Against lighties, the missing armor upgrade doesn't matter. It's the same as if they had fully upgraded cavalry that's cheaper. Exactly. 
So cavalry is the, the play, you know? The special event, uh, it's just a special event between Nikov, Winchester and uh, Mr. Yo. Oh, and Mr. Yo is open here. Uh, uh, that That's going to hurt a lot. That's really going to hurt a lot. Hallelujah. And uh, Mr. Yo heavily committing onto monks here, but yeah, th there's just nothing he can do against that amount of uh, ladies, right? Only uh, with fletching as well. Full upgrades here on Winchester's Lighties. We see counter raids incoming though. Let's see how much they can do, but Winchester is going to react immediately as well. With his own uh, units. And the uh, population has plummeted heavily from Mr. Yo. And there are raids going on all over the place. All over the place. Mr. Yo doesn't have. A single second to breathe anymore. 115 population for Mistio against 140. Never going to be a good sign here. Uh, barracks being added. I don't think Winchester needs that at all. Full focus on Lydis is enough. Yo, finally went lighties. Yeah, that's something I was uh, suggesting him to do all the time. Now he finally is doing it. And we see another castle here by Winchester. Should be his fourth then. Did he lose one? Apparently he lost one. I guess here, right? Was it here? I guess it was there. We still have quite some gold to take from. Uh, around 10,000. And we have four there, and the rest is here, around 3,000. Is Mizio going to be able to wall that in time, really? It looks like that. If uh, the Lightyears would break in here, that would be disastrous. But now he's just uh, <clears throat> moving around and gathering a <clears throat> bigger army here in front. Albadiers. Oh boy. Albadiros. <clears throat> Lithuanian's trash is even superior than Poles. Don't underestimate the wing tusser. Yo is going to play forever. I don't think that's going to be the case. Because I think <clears throat> the game is going to end in the next two minutes. And Winchester is going to claim the victory. I guess Pulse with the UT is way better. Exactly. How? Okay, Winchester, that's a bad fight. <clears throat> but how is Yo going to fight against this army composition? Like, it's not happening. Let's, let's be real for a second. This army is just unbeatable for Winchester right now. Or for Mr. Yo. Winchester is just completely crushing this fight. And we will see monks going down. And with these monks, and with these units... Going down, so are the hopes of Mr. Yo winning this game, and he will call the GG, and we see it. Guys, when did I say two more minutes? It was... Now, I said it. Here, two minutes, right? What is it? 46? Yeah, two minutes, roughly. I cannot complain about my precision here. I cannot complain about my precision here. Let's take a look at the stats. <clears throat> yeah, economy was better for Mr. Yo, but military just uh, prevailing in every single situation here by Winchester. APM, let's take a look at the beautiful APM with the Capture H Pro. Let's go. And uh, guys. 
We finished game number three. Game number three goes to Winchester. And we will jump into game number four in a 